What's up guys, Jared Spalding here and today I just wanted to quickly discuss another powerlifting update and usually I don't give these for non-competition lifts but Larry more than deserves um, to be the exception because holy crap, this is absolutely incredible. So I uh, have post notifications on for him and many other powerlifters mostly because their lifting videos inspire me. And Larry just did something I did not think was possible for any human being to do. Yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh shit! Stop! Stop! So yeah, you as you can see, 900 pound deadlift, and this is. Not too long after his viral 870 pound deadlift, that was on April 5th, so not too long ago, he put 870. Now, there's the speed on this. That looked pretty easy, but then look at the speed on the 900 again. One more time. Yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh! I'd say 900 was easier. And, I mean, I could be a little bit wrong, obviously, in terms of how it feels, because I'm not him. I don't know how it felt to pull, but it looked to me that the 900 was a bit easier. Um, which is kind of scary, because he's still weighing 270, and he's competing at 308 at the U.S. Open. So, obviously, bulking that much could hurt his leverages. I really don't know. But Larry and his coach, John Gaglione, definitely know what they're doing better than I do. It's his body, not mine. Um, so he knows how he's going to respond. And, <laughs> I mean, if this trend continues a couple of weeks, pulling a 30-pound deadlift PR, making it look easy, I don't know what's going to happen at the Open. But what I do know is that a 900-pound deadlift at 270 is beyond incredible. I mean, he's very close to... I mean, obviously not the world record, but for full meet, I think he's pretty close to a world record if he did compete at 275. And even at 308, he's not super far behind the full meet world record um, if he could pull that in the meets. And he's around four weeks out from the U.S. Open, so he's still got plenty of time, obviously, to get stronger. But yeah, um, I'm very much looking forward to see what he can accomplish at the current U.S. Open because if these trends continue, he's going to actually uh, destroy a world record that I didn't think was going to be broken for many many more years so that being said I just wanted to give you guys this quick update 